Hi everyone, so this is to give you a little taster of our gallery. Picture this, art gallery in Bournemouth. This is a lovely arcade that we're in here. And um, in the centre of town. So it's all getting very Christmassy. Just going to have a little look in our window here. So here you can see the range of artists that we've got. Um, we've got actually up to nine artists at the moment. Um, just pretty so nice at Christmas decorations here. And on this wall you can see here we've got Claire Sinkinson's work. Claire is a local artist and she's travelled all around the world and her art is inspired from that. Street scenes, seascapes. And we're just coming into the gallery now. Um, so we mainly sell our work, all original artwork on the walls um, and prints in the browsers and we do do a few other things like cards, you know, coasters, key rings, prints. Uh, if you need anything anything else here you can see our, <laughs> our tinsel here just to bring a bit of sparkle to our um, Christmas show. So here's the work of Sarah Good. Sarah does acrylic pouring and she uses resin and um, she uses a blowtorch. She does all sorts of things. Um, if you come into the gallery, you can read a little bit more about her work here. And um, just come in a little bit, you can see a little bit more of them. You can see the detail here, very eye catching. And uh, People are asking us if we're doing well and it's good to say we are having some sales which is great since the lockdown um, so that's lovely so do come in see if there's anything you like if you're interested in our artwork this is Sophie Killock's work Sophie is um, a local artist inspired by the sea from different areas and she does um, canvases and then she frames them as well so you've got a variety of options there if you would like any of her work um, and Sophie is actually joining our online shop as well on our website soon so look out for her we've just begun an online shop which is very exciting and um, this is Kath Durkin and Kath is from Essex so she's come all the way to Bournemouth to display this artwork. Beautiful. M much of it is inspired by Norsey Woods. And um, we've got some smaller works here. Okay, just some cards as well and some lovely prints. Then um, this is actually Julie Farley's work. Julie is one of our art directors along with me. And I'm Kate Ma. So Julie Farley does portraits mainly. So let's have a little look at her work here. This is her wall. And she she's inspired by lots of different things, icons, um, and also she will paint things from the news, which interests her. This is actually from the foot and mouth here in the middle. Um, and diff different, different things. She does pet portraits, takes commissions. She might now be booked up till Christmas, but if you would like a commission, then please get in touch with us. Um, you can do that through the website. Julie's work is online as well. Um, got little items on the table, so you know, don't worry about prices. There's some very good prices here, especially with the little ones. Um, something for everybody. I've got some nice prints. Um, most of those were my work actually on there, and this wall is my work as well. So I'm Kate Ma. I'm a local artist. Um, inspired by the sea and landscape. Um, I live very close to the beach, 
<laughs> so I'm very fortunate to be be there and get all this inspiration. Um, so these are some watercolours that I did based on some sunsets in Christchurch. There might be some, some sunrises as well. Quite experimental. Okay, so just taking you up the stairs now. Um, see some more of the artworks available. And my work is online as well, so this work is online if you want to have a look and there are more available too. So I'm quite inspired by the light um, that you get here and the colours. And I'm just going to come up and probably go out a little bit so you can see these better. That's a view from Bournemouth here. And Christchurch Harbour, Pool Harbour, also inspiration for me. Um, let's come on to now to Gabrielle Bill. Gabrielle Bill does some fantastic work and she hides figures in her work. So come and have a look, see if you can spot the figures. This one's fairly obvious. <laughs> the other ones are not so obvious but very exciting, it's quite fun. So come and have a look. The beautiful, beautiful colours and the videos don't do it complete justice. It is worth coming and having a look at what is available. Absolutely stunning. Now these are some of my trees, I've got many many more tree work available online, let's do have a look. Our notice board, <laughs> getting a bit of a Christmas theme going on here. So yes we've got opportunities for artists, um, we are getting quite a lot of applications at the moment but it's uh, yeah we, we're always on the lookout so if you would like to apply to exhibit with us please go ahead. At this stage, we are charging for wall space and um, commission. We teach Yo Julie, um, who does the artwork downstairs as well, the portraits. Um, she teaches yoga classes here, and we're going to start again in the new year when restrictions allow. Okay, this is Chris Coates. Chris Coates does these beautiful landscape seascapes and they're all about um, 40 by 50 centimetres or 16 by 20 inches, framed nicely. So if you see anything you'd like to buy just let us know, we can reserve it for you if you'd like to come and have a look. Um, and the artist can arrange postage as well if you would prefer it posted to you. Um, so this is another one of Julie's. Another one of Julie's. Now here is some work by Rob Hughes. Rob Hughes is a local artist and he's inspired by our culture, how we view uh, women and makeup. Um, and he has quite a lot of in-depth themes in his work. Um, you can see here, got a crucifix there and um, yeah, it's just very deep. And then we've got some seascapes as well. The landscape, sorry. Work is stunning. So, yeah, if you see anything you like, just let us know. And thank you for watching. Thank you, bye.